Good morning, dudes. How is it going? Today we're playing a little bit more of Dota 1v1 because I feel like it. Honestly, that's, that's the reason. I don't know. I just think it's kind of fun. We could try to challenge Bob to it. Like, he's here right now. Oh, I don't know. Do you want to? Oh, let's do that. Let's do it. Let me, let me send him a message really quick. Let's actually, let's actually go. On. Let's get him in here. Oh, that would be so cool. I totally want to 1v1 Bob. I totally do. Come on, come on, come on, Bob. Come on, Bob. Do it. Get in here. Come on, Bob. Come on. Yes. Yes, I got him. Sweet. Great. I love it. Okay. Uh, let's make it the password really quick. Otherwise, people will join. They always do. Okay. And 1v1 solo made. Hell yeah. Anything else? So we should probably set the server. Uh, we use the server, yes, it's not automatic. Automatic is usually fine, but sometimes it messes up, and honestly, this is just a click away, so, you know, whatever. Oh, starting team random, yes. We should, oh, hero? As a? We should do Shadow Fiend, we should totally, we should totally do Shadow Fiend. We should totally do Shadow Fiend, like this, there's Shadow Fiend, Shadow Fiend. Yeah. SF. Let's do this. Let's do this, okay. And we're gonna do it properly this time around, you know? It's just like, we're the same hero. That's how you really should play it. That's how it really belongs. Anyway, let's go and see what we can make happen here. And now, oh my god, he stole Team Faku, that bastard! That's my team. Team Faku is the best team. Okay, let me explain why. We're gonna, we're gonna play as this team, right? We're gonna have banners. We're gonna have we're gonna have the name. We've got, we've got everything. And then we go super competitive. And as we are standing on the TI six stage, Faku realizes, but shit, you know, we already got our name. I just sponsored him. Boom! And then we sponsored by Faku. Can you can you win more at life? I don't think you can. I really don't. Okay, now I totally need this, but I'm not willing to pay this much money. <laughs> Come on, Bob! Get started already! Go! Bob! Damn it! <laughs> and Bob, he's talking about shenanigans. Look at him. So. Uh, wave bam. I like, I like the wave bam because it gives you a lot of damage. I think it's actually the most damage you can get early on. With, like just your because not because of the money but because of your limited inventory space and shadow fiend really like for the very like first few levels is all about getting last hits in so you get those souls going and afterwards of course this is gonna come down to some races now i'm very rusty with shadow fiend so I'm probably gonna fail horribly but we also need to keep in mind we're playing against bob bob is terrible <laughs> so we should be fine <laughs> oh, let him send, uh, let's send him a smiley. What, what do we have? Meepo, Patch. I like the chicken. <laughs> have a chicken. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. what the hell happened to that Second chicken? That poor little chicken. Oh my god. I feel awful for it. <laughs> oh man. Okay then. Well, this whole waiting period is kind of silly. Is there a bounty rune mode? No, it's haste, double damage, region, yeah, but there's no bounty. Oh, what you doing? What you doing? Why is there, why is there no bounty? The game there should really be a bounty. I'm just saying. Just saying. Anyway. It's a perfect time to start a new collection. A collection of Bob Tears. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, so okay, we've got a bunch of creeps here already. That's pretty cute. And there you go. So it's really all about getting those first few last hits, right? You spiral out of control afterwards because every last hit gives you more damage, so that's gonna make the next one easier. You see, I missed that one. That's really bad. I wouldn't have missed it if I had more last hits. And you know, that's just kind of how it goes. That's just kind of how it goes. You know, Shadow Fiend is really all about all about just controlling everything and um, getting started. 
And after he gets started, he becomes really, really powerful. But he needs to get started first. And that's, you know, that's his biggest problem. That's his biggest problem. Otherwise, he's a fantastic hero. <laughs> and the coolest part about Shadowfin is just that he's, like, a ton of fun to play. <laughs> that is something that you cannot take away from the fellow. And hey, we're actually doing really well now. Uh, yeah, we are definitely outlasting him easily. So all we need to do is not fuck up our races. That is uh, going to be the next important step. And now we should be just fine. Now, something we could do right here is just get straight boots and try to go for some early, early kills. But, you know, I think that's a little silly. Let's just keep it slow. Just play it slow. We got so much more damage than he does right now that our last hits are so easy. <laughs> and he's already crying. Oh, Bob, you're so cute. Look at him. He's got one! Oh, my God! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Bob, you cutie pie. Oh, aren't you just adorable? Aren't you just adorable? Okay, there we go. Got this. <laughs> uh, I'm not the worst Shadow Fiend, I have to admit. Like, this was maybe an unfair pick. Because I know Bob doesn't really play Shadow Fiend, but I just think Shadow Fiend is a really cute hero. So, that's why I went for him. And he is that typical one-on-one -on -one mid hero. He just is. Like, that is all, all the four that went into it. I didn't pick a hero explicitly just to stomp Bob. Though, now that I think about it, that would have been really... I think that is actually, you know... Like, yeah, it's kind of a dick move, but you got to keep in mind, we're talking about Bob here. I think that's quite appropriate. <laughs> here we go. Let's get and get these guys. And... Oh, wow. Totally gave him that one. Totally gave him that one. Okay. Got to get this going. And now, what we want to do right here is... Actually, just go for this. Got him. Sweet. <laughs> Sweet. And invisibility. Oh my god. We might be able to finish with just that. We might be able to finish with just that. Okay. He doesn't know. He doesn't know. So we're gonna bait. I think we're gonna bait him. I'm waiting. He's gonna come back. Didn't he buy a TP? Is he just walking into the lane? Huh. Maybe he's on me. Maybe he got wards. Where did he go? Oh, there he is. Okay, then. So, you don't want to do this. Enemy heroes missing? What the hell are you doing up there? Oh, great. Missed that. <laughs> Doesn't even matter. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Rematch? Rematch? Your pick. Yeah, look. Look. Now, this was my pick. Now he, get, now he gets to pick a hero. Now it's his choice. I still think, yes, I think. I think the settings are fine. Okay. Oh, wait. No, no. Actually, we need to remove the password. Otherwise, he doesn't get into the lobby. Yes. No, 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 no. He's crying. He's crying. And apparently there was a bit of an issue with the server. I didn't have anything, but let's go ahead and just set it to automatic then. You know, maybe that's gonna fix it. So, what does he want? He's thinking. He's thinking. Huh? Yeah, come on, buddy. Come on, let me know. Kunka? Kunka. 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 Let's go ahead and do it. Kunka, Kunka, Kunka. Okay, then. Now that's fine. We can't do that. We can't smack him ab about with Kunka. I really like Kunka actually, so that shouldn't be much of an issue. Um, mm -hmm. it's loading in. Here we go. Okay then. Now I'm not really sure how to play Kunka one v one. I really, I'm not convinced that I know. But you know, there's you something new every day. And also, I got my look. I love my Kunka. I think my Kunka looks awesome. Uh, uh, come on, look at the fellow. Look at him! 
<laughs> and I got some sweet jams on them too, so. Hey. Anyway. Uh, Quelling Blade. Sword Shield. I think we're gonna go for Tangos. Okay. This may seem really odd. But I just want to maximize my cleave. And I think this is what it's gonna come down to. Whoever cleaves more and better. So, as long as we maximize just that, I think it's going to work out in our favor. And we won't need a shield, really. Because we're not really going to just, like, attack him directly. Whenever we fight, it's going to be over pretty much instantly. I think the first, like, the first kill we are probably ever going to see will be at level 6. So, <laughs> actually, this is probably going to take a little while. You know, Kunka and Kunka... That's that's a tanky hero with not that crazy of a burst amount, you know. So I don't know. Oh, it's gonna be tricky, but bully, bully. Look at my sword. I love my sword. Look at this shit. Oh, it's so good. Come on, come on, it is. Oh, this is beautiful. I think it's fantastic. Okay. Now. Run up the sail while we've got the tide. Run up the sail while we've, while we've got the tide. Or something like that. I don't know. He's a he's a pirate. So <laughs> a pirate's As life. It's wish. for me. I don't know how to think because I don't know that it works. Honestly. So what did he buy? He went for something very similar to mine. Actually, oh, that's not surprising. Like, I guess we share a thought process there. I should actually just go for the harassment. I should really just go for the harassment. Like, he went for the deny. Which is nice, but I really, I think our priority right here is to get as much damage in on him as we can. And avoid taking damage ourselves. So he's kind of forced to actually, like, hit for something right here. Yep, and we didn't get cleaved. So that puts him at a disadvantage, because as you can tell, he already... He already used a Tangle. I well, I, I, I don't think we should have. Like, what for? We haven't really taken damage yet. Bye. Boom, baby. <laughs> and I, uh, by the way, just a little tiny little thing, but uh, getting that that hit on him is actually not worth it. In general, you want to hit the Creeps instead. The Creeps got the same amount of armor. Or generally, they got less, actually. And, oh, nice. He hit me with that. That's pretty cute. But not all, not only that, right? The damage you you cleave hits hits for the same, right? Like the damage you deal to the creep gets cleaved. So I think that's how it works at least. But the cleave damage does not get reduced by armor anymore. So you're in a position where, as long as the hero got you know just a tiny, just a tiny, 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 tiny bit more armor than the creeps. You're gonna actually deal more damage if you if you hit the creeps. So, uh, I don't know. Set my Hello there. Boom. I okay, I got a cleave. Got him. And we can get boots too. Sweet. Sweet. <laughs> Fantastic. Got him again. <laughs> Sit down, son. He played this greedy. The only reason why we got him, uh, and that's actually like the reason why I initiated, I saw him step into tower range. And that is that is the only reason why we were able to get that kill, because he walked into tower range, and that one tower hit made all the difference, especially since he doesn't have a shield. So, not great. No, no, it's pretty pointless. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, well. I guess at least we got an invisibility. Also, we got boots now. I wonder if the bottle was actually the right decision. Maybe just getting face boots early. Would have been better. Oh, hello there. Yeah, look at that. I am just cute. Look at my torrent. Man, I love my torrent. I love everything about my kunke. I think my kunke is great. <laughs> Come on, you gotta agree with me on that. I don't know, I actually kind of like the Veil Torrent more. I wish you could combine those two gems. Like, the Veil Blade uh, actually got the Torrent gem on it. And I don't know who, who, what exactly it is that got the gems on it. 
No, it doesn't. You couldn't put that in there. But I put it some somewhere else. And I really want to have like that spinning effect. And then the whale as well. Like kind of at the same time. That would be so cool. But you can't have that. That doesn't work. <laughs> Which does make me quite sad. Oh, look at that. He knew. How? I don't know if that was intentional or if that was just lucky. I change tax. Hmm. No, that's something you have to keep in mind, though, right? That he dodged that is pretty significant because. Fair enough. Because you know we gotta keep in mind. Does he have this warded? Did he? Did the creeps give him vision? I don't think they should have. I don't know. Maybe they did. That's probably probably the creeps gave him vision of me. Yeah, aren't you just cute? Oh. Okay, okay. I can tell where this is going. That's fine. That is fine. Let's go and get those face boots going. The face boots are going to be incredible. First of all, maximizing movement speed is incredibly important in any medium on medium match matchup. Secondly, the bonus damage with the cleave? Hell yeah, girl. Let's do it. Now, we've got a double damage right here. If we land anything on him, he's dead. And he knows it. I can't hide for that long. Yeah, I could try to, but honestly, that's just kind of silly. Well, Stan will sit in the lane. If he wants to stay out of the lane for like two minutes, feel free. <laughs> so you say. Oh. Fair enough. No, that's gonna connect. Got him! Got him! Sit down! <laughs> <laughs> baby <laughs> oh stomping all over bomb space so that concludes our best of three bitch i won on my pick and i won on your pick sit down <laughs> and it wasn't even close oh well so that was a, that was actually really fun i hope you enjoyed the video if you did don't forget to leave a rating on the video and see you tomorrow goodbye everybody